Oh, thanks. Play bitter. Wow. <laughs> Here we are from Norfolk, Virginia. I've never been here before. We're going to be starting the vlog here and probably ending it back home. This week, we're doing a very, very short trip, Tuesday to Thursday here already. Tonight, we will probably hit a barcade with some pals. That is typically the way we go, but tomorrow we are doing a live dynamite rampage and elevation. So let's see what we will do there. I know what I'm doing. I have a pretty big match. It's myself versus Brian Danielson. Yes, the American Dragon, that Brian Daniels. Who would have thought? So very excited for that, a tad nervous. You know, it's a real test of my skills, I think. We'll see what happens. So let us not delay this any further. Let's go uh, to this barcade. Sure, there's not a lot of easy ones left, so. No. I, you see that? It's hard. I gotta move a white one. dynamite day i have a huge match tonight i'm ecstatic for it i'm excited for it but a little nervous which is honestly the first time in many moons many moons where i've been nervous about a pro wrestling match but before we do that i gotta go get covid tested and as soon as i'm done covid tested i will be streaming a very little bit with my good pal adam cole we will be playing that new halo infinite beta right here so uh, clips from that and then straight to dynamite where well i slay the american drag I'm Evil Udo! And I am the Chugs. You're live from uh, my, my hotel bedroom and we're playing Halo Infinite today. Ah, close, close. I am the I am the king of knocking their shield down where they're like one shot away. And then dying? And yeah. that's just what happened right there. Every single time. <laughs> Chad, I'm so happy right now. This is the best. We get to play, play in Halo. Play in Halo I know. Halo with Uno. As soon as I saw it was games. out, I knew, I was like, oh, he's gonna be so excited. Oh, man. Oh, oh! I didn't realize there was a, That's a dip me. there. Always falling off the edge. Uh, oh my god, that Get was out great. of there. <laughs> Get out of there. Oh, oh there, hell and, yeah. And almost one shot left. No more grenades. The shield re replenishes after a while, though, right? It, it does. Oh, there it heck is. yeah. Oh! But I got spanked. Okay. Well, I, I mean, spanked. yeah, that's yeah. true. Mate, or is, does the C just like, oh, oh, oh. Okay, you got God. it. You're in. That okay. was close. Oh, now you have overshield. So if you hit right bumper, you'll get an extra shield. There it is. There it is. Ah, uh, well worth it. Nice. That was a perfect time to use it too. You're about to die, and then your whole shield came back up. Benico. Hello, oh. friends. Ah, uh, you're here twice. That must mean one thing. It's video game time. It's video game time. Actually, people have requested you because you're so knowledgeable. Oh, well, literally, thank, they know. Thank we talk you about very much. it all, all the time. time. All the time. You haven't actually been around, so you, I, you have a lot to catch up on. Yeah. Do tell what you're actively playing. Now. Well, uh, too much. As I texted mm -hmm. you before, uh, bought so many. Yeah, games. I bought so many games the last week. So, uh, uh, Shin Megami Tensei Five, mm -hmm. uh, the GTA Trilogy. Did you? Okay. So before we get into the next yes. one. 
Not a great remaster. Not, not but at all. Still a fun game. I'm very, I bought it on Switch because I want to play it mm-hmm. like on a plane. I popped it on some San Andreas. Yeah. It feels like what it felt like. Yes. But I could tell they done the way pop-in better. is just as bad. Yeah, they could have yeah. done way better. But, you know, good as it may, I just downloaded the uh, Halo Infinite multiplayer beta. It is very good. Uh, Forza very Horizon good. 5. Also very um, good. I got back into Animal Crossing because they just released the new update. So I haven't touched any of that. I, they've just added, like, a ton of stuff. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, uh, okay. It's everything else escaping me right now. Oh, um, uh, the biggest thing, I can't believe I forgot about this, I am now an MMO junkie. No. And I had No, don't do this. I did it. Is this Luther's doing? Uh, so at first I didn't I didn't think I would be like him because he stays up till four or five in the morning mm-hmm. you know, on his laptop playing uh, World of Warcraft. And I do the same thing now, but on Final Fantasy fourteen. And uh, uh you the I free did trial the got tweets. me. I saw the, the tweet. Free trial got me. You don't have to pay anything until level sixty or something. And I just reached that cap and I just bought all the expansions. The new one comes out in two weeks and yeah. This uh, is why I've never jumped in. I know <laughs> why I would do it. Luther has been trying to sell me on it. It's such a time sink, and I wake up I I wake up early as it is anyway. But and now go to I, bed late too, right? Right, but now I wake up with a purpose, and that's uh, go to Eorzea, and oh boy, and it's, just, it's, it's so bad. It's so bad. It's an addiction. So myself, I've also been playing Forza. Okay. Also, I also just put in some Halo Infinite time. I have no affinity for Halo personally, so I, I was a PlayStation yeah. and Nintendo kid growing okay. up. Okay. So I played a bit of Halo 2. Other than that, <laughs> couldn't care less about right. it. Right. But I'll tell you this, Halo Infinite is really fun. It's such a good game. It's so smooth. Yeah. It plays super well. I'm actually really excited for the campaign. I'm, I'm kind of okay with them delaying it a full year because yes. it worked. It, it yes. actually it, worked. They it feels like so polished game. for yeah. a game too. Yeah. And then uh, I know one game that you've been playing that I've been playing and put a considerable amount of time to yeah. Unpacking. Oh, Unpacking! Yes. Yes, I just started this the other day and it's such a zen game, so relaxing. I say it's my podcast game. Mm-hmm. I put a video game Same. podcast on Same. and just unpack boxes. Yeah, I throw Giant Bombs podcast <laughs> of the week and I just unpack boxes yeah. and, and boxes. And then I mean, you were saying that you run into real life problems as is you don't have enough space to put I d- so like it's such a zen experience but then as you progress into the game you realize that it is much like life and right. there's not enough space right for it. you can't throw anything out so yeah. you might as well put a place for it you know find a place for it well uh, I'm sure we'll uh, see each other again yeah, talk video games Absolutely. Uh, probably another list of eight games each in about two weeks <laughs> see you Sopranico see ya we are getting right into the action here on Dynamite what it takes to get to that stage. He's gonna do it. Wow. You're gonna chop me, chop me harder, or I'm gonna slap you in the face. That's what I got out of that exchange. Brian Daniels reminding Aubrey Edwards he has till five on the clean break. Danielson is a competitive guy. And you're right, it all counts, both you guys. A little battle mind game going on here that Evil Uno is trying to get the upper hand on. And Evil Uno, a bit of a violence party here in the corner on Daniels. Combination of strikes that has uh, Brian kind of reevaluating his strategy, perhaps. Oh, 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 oh. Brian Danielson is wrestling not because he needs the money. Oh, but Brian oh. Danielson to win the AEW World Title. And Evil Uno hit the high boot across the jaw of Danielson, Rips. and now the scent on Atomic. Oh, Danielson, the knees up. And Uno, after having his Fine, tenderized by Danielson earlier. Oh, psycho knee by Danielson. Danielson using the flat of his boot to pound the head of Evil Uno. And now to the triangle sleeper, and immediately Uno goes out. There is Uno, the American Dragon, Brian Danielson. And look at that, Danielson not letting go immediately. Sending a message not just to Evil Uno, Oh, hey! It's a vlog. It's a vlog, boys. Yeah, is it, they're uh, rolling. A couple of vlog oh, I boys. It was a rolling. picture. I was no, for no, picture. no. We're not taking the picture. Yeah, yeah, the you guys hey, take we're pictures? We're uh, the hair and makeup. The seamstress. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Most yeah. perverts. Uh, BB yeah, King. Couple. <laughs> BB King. BB King. BB King. Didn't he uh, own a chain of clubs?
Uh, I've been they to did. a BB yeah, King they, club. They, I think they, I wrestled like, there the on the Evolve show. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. New, downtown New York. Remember Gabe? No. <laughs> I think he's employed elsewhere now. Oh, yeah, where? Yeah. And, uh, Dragon Gate USA. USA. It's true. Oh, yeah, Dragon Gate Did you guys USA. know uh, uh, Gabe is a playable character in the first ECW video games? Uh, I, don't, I believe I don't. Anarchy Rules or whatever it was called. Yeah, yeah. yeah that was Yeah, a, yeah. He used to, uh, Anarchy Rules. He used to sell the pamphlets and stuff. So uh, he has an actual okay. voiceover line by game about... So this is a vlog. This is a vlog. We just talk about. I literally told you boys, uh, hey, I really got to film some stuff yeah. because uh, Brian Danielson this beat. Sh- but I did. forgot I to say you had, you had a big match. Yes, yes I did. I did. Great. I, I heard. Didn't, didn't go so well. No, no I definitely. Okay. I, you know, there's always next we, time. We, uh, we had a big match once. Yeah. Sting, right? Against Sting. Yeah, that was yeah, wild. Yeah. Once. That was a while ago. Yeah, that was yeah. a while ago. We've yeah. also had big matches against each other in front of like 20 20- Yes, uh, yes. Pick, yes. pick our spots here at the AEW. Yes, yes. Well, when's your next one? Months from now? Well, I don't know. The next time Sting's available. A, I think we just picked a fight with Eddie Kingston. Tonight. You should. Yeah. You should. Uh, yeah, that guy. It's the Player Uno vlog. Yeah, it is the Player Uno vlog. A couple of perverts. You don't do quick hair and makeup. Never. Well, fairly rare. I mean, it's my hair and makeup. I guess the. The quick cuts. <laughs> Paul Turner's in hair and makeup, guys. Oh, for real? Big, big pervert, Paul. Paul Turner's. Big pervert, Paul. Big pervert, Paul. And that hair slick back. Show your face, you pervert. Get, get some eyeshadow done. Show your face, done. pervert. Get some eyeshadow done. Show your face, pervert. Oh, Daddy! Oh, no. He's running pervert. away like a scolded dog. Oh, there it is. Well, uh, what a great vlog. One of the biggest huh? perverts of all time, Paul Turner. Oh, <laughs> It's true, you know, a lot of people say that. Oh boy, he's another pervert. <laughs> well, uh, Everybody's on, pervert on that note, uh, that was a that was a pervert. Uh, All right. Oh my God, look at, wow. <laughs> See you, friends. <laughs>
It's you're gonna going to happen. See, you're going to see clips of a Twitch stream right after this. Guarantee it. Because uh, Miss Suno just went to our PO box and we got a buttload of gifts to open. Yeah, I hope there, there's all kinds of figurines in it. I just assume it's figurines at this point. Most hey, likely. Hey, uh, uh, you want you want to you want to intro this Twitch uh, somehow? Moi? You? Moi? You? Uh, I guess. How would you head to, uh, your choice. What do you want to do? What do I want to do? Uh, you want to put a hand over the camera? You want to? You want the camera to go towards you or? Uh... Yeah, I'll do. A, I'll do. Wait, I got it. Okay, got you got it. it. All right, I'm ready. I'm ready. Whoa. All right. Shall we unbox Mrs. Uno? Sure, I don't know that? why I did this weird magic motion hand thing. All right, Mrs. Uno, uh, pass on the first gift. So this one was actually hand. Whoa, look at this bag. It's it's transparent. Oh, uh, yeah, look at that. My pal has given me the Dr. Nick figurine. There you go. His pants are translucent due to- uh, Translucent? Or, or, or you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> Transparent. Wait, transparent. You know what? Let me uh, let me remove this uh, filter. There. Now you can see his green pants. There you go. We got ourselves Dr. Nick's office. Next gift is from Michael. From Philadelphia. Michael from Philadelphia. What did Michael from Philadelphia send us uh, in our P.O. box? The Wrestling Independent says, uh, First, I want to say that I'm a big fan living in Phil. I was able to catch you in your Shikara days. Thank you. Secondly, as a collector, I want to help you with your new Simpsons collection. I know you understand, but my collection is mostly wrestling paraphernalia, and I also have a bat cave in my house, but I know how my wife is when I pick up a new collection idea. Yes, uh, Miss Zuno. Not super excited about the money I'm spending, but it's okay. It's okay. Um, is it? It is. It comes with the... Oh, it's a podcast. Wrestling Independent is his podcast. Thank you, Michael. We got Resort Smithers. Resort Smithers. Smithers, but from the resort when he went on vacation. You remember that? I believe it's when uh, Homer takes over, right? Punches Mr. Burns in the face, and there you go. The second figure is, oh, even better. Brain Freeze Bart. <laughs> I didn't know they made a figure for this. That's awesome. I think there's more figures than you. Oh, there's like are. 250. Thank you very much. Michael from Philadelphia. Uh, what is the next package, Miss Zuno? The next package is from Philip. Philip. From Sparta. Sparta. Wisconsin. Hi, Evil Uno. I've been enjoying all your vlogs and Twitch streams. Very happy to be a subscriber. I have sent these items to help grow your collection. Please give Mrs. Uno my best. All hail the Dark Order, PKNC13. Thank you, Philip. I appreciate you. From Philip is. Batman animated series, the Kenner original animated series. That is a my most latest collection that I have been uh, spending a ton of money on. Batman animated series, Kenner figure of Killer Croc in great condition, carded as well. Beautiful, thank you, Philip. All right, Miss Suno, please pass on the next one. It's the Riddler. The Riddler, also in great condition on carded. The Riddler with question mark launcher, you remember that? You remember that from the animated series? I believe you do. And then finally, score. Philip, thank you very much for Catwoman. Price tag still included. It's an old price tag too, yeah, I bet. Yeah, it is. You can Got tell. from Walmart. So that means he's had it for a while. With whipping arm action, claw and hook, and it's carded. So thank you very much, Philip. If you would like to send me something at the P.O. Box, you can. Hello. Maybe I'll do over here. Hello, send it there. Would you like to, it doesn't even have to be figures. Do you want to send fan art? Do you want to send a letter? I don't know what you'd like to send me, but if you'd like to send anything to me or Mrs. Uno, that is the address and it's going to disappear in three, two, one. Perfect, I hope you took note. I hope you took note. Not gonna be able to have my foot in my. <laughs> it's a brand new day! Yay! Yay! We're, uh, we're going to Auto the Comic Con today and uh, probably going to go try and find some other toy stores in the area. Look, it's a day with us and editor Patrick and his missus. Uh, we're gonna try and go and enjoy ourselves and maybe find some figurines. What will you be looking for, Mrs. Una? I'm just happy we're going on a nerdy double date. And uh, you're gonna get to enjoy it with us just many weeks later. 
<laughs> bye bye. Bye. Big day, it's a big day. We are back from Ottawa Comic Con. I did not take a shot of what I got at Ottawa Comic Con, so I thought I should show some of that stuff today. Now, uh, one thing of note, I will tell you this. Didn't get anything from the vintage store, and I didn't personally purchase this either. In fact, a, a friend of mine, Dave, was literally buying the figurines. I was scanning figurines, looking for Simpson stuff, looking for Batman stuff, and there they are. Two beautiful Simpson figurines, but someone is buying them. Ah, oh, unfortunate, only to find out it's my friend Dave and he's buying them for me. So, courtesy of Dave, who, is, who has given us the uh, Dr. Nick figure previously, we've got Chief Wiggum. Ooh, also, great quality box. Not a single dent on there. Very impressed, very impressed. And Barney added to the to the collection. We've done a lot of uh, collecting without having to collect uh, this week. Honestly, it's been fairly nice. Our collection is getting well ahead. You can uh, you can send us stuff at our P.O. box up here. Good job, Editor Patrick. As well as you can uh, follow us on the YouTube down below. Make sure you hit that subscription button because you will be notified of our next ventures here on uh, YouTube, here on the vlog. Uh, next week we are in, oh man, where am I next week? Chicago. I'm going to Chicago. What else are we going to do? I have no idea. I don't plan this far ahead. I plan the day beforehand. Just know I'm in Chicago next week on the YouTube vlog. Make sure you hit that YouTube. Make sure you say a nice thing down below. Be good to your fellow human. And remember, Evil Luno is great. See you next time! Ah.